I'm the disc golf guy. 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 And this is my video blog. I'm the disc golf guy and this is my video blog. We are here on Monday at the USDGC. I was able to run around the course, get a handful of warm-up shots from our players, as well as a few quick interviews. I had even more for you, but I'm still learning the new camera, so unfortunately some of those were muted and they won't be seen. 2001 World Champ Cam Todd, what you got going on here, pal? Well, we got art and we got disc golf art. And now uh, I have to assume that you're the uh, talented man behind the scenes here? I am the one doing the paintings. Um, you can come check them out here at the USDGC. They're going to be set up all week. And if somebody can't get here this week and they want to get some of these sweet paintings, how should they go about getting in touch with you? They should probably go on a computer and go to CameronToddArt.com or you can go to CameronToddArt at gmail.com. Leave me a message and I'll get right back with you. All right, well, good luck to you the rest of this week. Thanks so much, appreciate it. Brian Schweberger, you are a staple here at the USDGC. What keeps you coming back every year? Uh, great tournament, great course, bunch of great people. I think it's just great. <laughs> I guess so. Now, you had to qualify this year. You're in, uh, well, you're trying to. Yeah. What did you shoot and where are you sitting? Well, I've played twice. I shot 65, 67 this morning and 65 this afternoon. I'm sitting in uh, the fourth qualifying spot right now. There's about, I don't know, between 10 and 15 people still out on the course. All right, it's going to be close. We hope to see you out between the ropes this week. Appreciate it. Avery Jenkins, your 13th USDGC. What's so great about this week? It's the week you look forward to all year, you know. There's uh, four majors in the, in, the, in the sport of disc golf, and this is the last one of the year. And it's kind of what it, everything accumulates and builds up to throughout the season. And uh, awesome weather. Awesome course, the best competition in the world, you know, what gets better than this. Now, uh, I know you're vying for the title, as are so many other competitors, but one of the stories here is your fellow teammate, Paul McBeth. Uh, does he or anyone have it in him to take it down this week? Sure, yeah. He, uh, if he's going to be beat, it's going to be, you know, him beating himself. He has all the skill in the world to win, you know, any tournament out there. He's uh, such a solid player, not just based on the skill and ability, but his head game and his confidence these days is unstoppable. So, you know, and not to mention that lethal putt he has. Uh, <laughs> but, you know, it's it's him beating himself, if anything. I think he has the best chance to win. Um, obviously, Will Schuster winning the last two, last two times here. Obviously, the other contenders. But uh, phenomenal players. Like I said, the best players in the world are here this weekend. And uh, I think anybody has a really good shot. But, you know, some more than others. And... Uh, We'll see at the end of it all. All right. One of the exciting highlights of this week is the distance competition that we see out here. Uh, it's a great opportunity for you and the other long throwers. Uh, talk a little bit about what you're going to be doing to uh, throw some big D's this week. Yeah, it's always a, a fun exhibition. You know, kind of a little show off, uh, showcase of distance. And uh, yeah, we're looking forward to the qualifiers tomorrow because it all really comes down to qualifying for the showcase to throw over the lake. And uh, that's really what it's all about. And I've been in the showcase. I can't remember the last time I've been out of the showcase. You know, it's always building up to qualifying, getting to throw over the lake, and putting on a show for the for the gallery and the spectators. Always a good time. All right, best of luck to you this week. Awesome, thanks, Terry. For all you disc golf guy fans, this is a call day. Whatever. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh it's out of bounds. Anyways, it's Monday. Like I said, tomorrow we're gonna get some more action for you guys. I'm the disc golf guy. Let's see what Paul Ulibarri has to say. Against your suggestions, we have a new intro, Paul. I'm sorry to say that. What do you think about it? Pretty disappointed. I mean, uh, I always got excited to hear the disc golf guy theme song come on when I saw all the videos. So uh, I can't say that I'm pleased with your decision to switch it. Well, I can say, thanks to AJ Risley, we do have one for this week. But maybe there'll be a new one you like uh, next week. Is that possible? I don't think we should change it. I still, I'm still sticking to my initial decision of uh, keeping it on there. All right. Well, just for old time's sake, in case it never returns, why don't you tell everyone what it sounded like? <laughs>